nothing creates retro look quite like a full rigid frame, and the factory used just such a frame to set the stage for the dated yet modern look of the M90. The triangular swing arm has a single monoshock tucked away out of sight to take the sting out of bumpy roads without compromising the dated look. Front suspension runs with stiff, inverted, 43mm forks that provide 5.1 inches of travel adequate for a cruiser, but nothing to write home about. Fat tires contribute to the classic look, and they keep the mass of the bike near the ground, at least visually. The 120mm front tire and 200mm rear harken back to earlier cruiser styles, while the rims show a more contemporary style. On paper, the dual 290mm front discs and 275mm rear disc, with two pop calipers all around, would seem to be enough to control the M90. This is, unfortunately, not the case. The bike weighs in at 723 pounds, and on the road, the brakes seem barely adequate. A vigorous application of both front and rear brakes does their job, but the front alone feels less than confidence-inspiring. Keep this in mind, especially if you like to ride with a passenger.